You may have seen the news today about Bob Woodward's new book, which apparently spends 480 pages trashing the president. It's coming out next week, just in time to influence the election. None of that should surprise you. Bob Woodward dislikes Donald Trump. He's been very clear about that. Woodward works for Jeff Bezos's personal newspaper, The Washington Post, which has made defeating Donald Trump its all-consuming mission. So, of course, Bob Woodward's book is exactly what you thought it would be. What's surprising is that Donald Trump participated in making the book. The president sat for repeated interviews with Bob Woodward. Why in the world would he do that? Well, tonight, from a source who knows the answer to that mystery, Senator Lindsey Graham of South Carolina. It was Lindsey Graham who helped convince Donald Trump to talk to Bob Woodward. Lindsey Graham brokered that meeting. Lindsey Graham even sat in on the first interview between Bob Woodward and the president. How'd that turn out? Now, remember, Lindsey Graham is supposed to be a Republican, so why would he do something like that? You'd have to ask him. But keep in mind that Lindsey Graham has opposed, passionately opposed, virtually every major policy initiative that Donald Trump articulated when he first ran, from ending illegal immigration to pulling back from pointless wars to maintaining law and order at home. Lindsey Graham was against all of that more than many Democrats. 